Welcome to the Highway Oversize Overweight Credentialing System, also known as Hooks, user tutorial videos. This video will guide you through ordering a new thruway permit in Hooks at hooks.dot.ny.gov. This and other tutorial videos can be found by clicking the Help button at the top right of the company dashboard and on the landing page once the Logout button is clicked. Once logged into the company dashboard, click the New Permit link. Hooks will display four options. If you are unsure which permit you need, click I need help choosing the permit and Hooks will display the permit wizard which will ask you a series of questions and based on those answers will recommend the permit that best fits your need. Because I want to order a new thruway only permit, I will select other permit options from the options. Hooks will display a pop-up listing the other New York jurisdictions and agencies. Select the New York State Thruway Authority link to display the order permit screen. This screen will display all of your contact information that will appear on the permit being ordered. Be sure to enter any updated contact information if it is different from what is displayed. The primary delivery method is how you would like the issued permit delivered. Choose Web Download to get the permit directly from the company dashboard, choose Fax to have the permit faxed, or choose Email to have the permit sent to your inbox. Company Reference is an optional field on the permit application that enables users to associate a permit to a particular job, job number, or other internal tracking. This option is not required and has been provided as a service to Hooks companies. The Thruway offers five permit types from which to choose. There are three annual permits and two routed permits. Two of the annual permits require insurance and all three annual permits require an active NISDOT corresponding permit associated to the VIN. One of the routed permits, the Explosive Trip Permit, must have a valid Thruway Authority annual explosive permit on file. Please note that the New York State Thruway Authority link option can be selected for permits that are for thruway travel only. If your permit will include NISDOT and NISTA travel, select the NISDOT permit as the base permit. The Thruway Authority Annual Bulk Milk Permit does not require insurance on file. The Thruway Authority Annual Sealed Container Permit and the Thruway Authority Annual Steel Haulers Permits require companies to have an insurance accord on file. There is a separate video located on the page help at the top right of the dashboard titled Uploading Insurance Accords. Select one of these permit types from the Permit Type drop-down list and click the Next button. All three annual permits require an active NISDOT corresponding permit associated with the same VIN. If there are not any active corresponding annual permits, Hooks will alert the user once the Next button is clicked. The user will then need to cancel the throughway permit return to the dashboard, and order the corresponding NISDOT permit. Once the NISDOT permit has been issued, the user can then restart the Thruway Annual Permit order. On the Vehicle and Information screen, after selecting or entering the vehicle information and dimensions, clicking the Next button will alert the user if they do not have an active corresponding NISDOT permit on file with the VIN entered. If this message displays, you must save and exit, go back to the dashboard, and order the corresponding NISDOT permit with the VIN that is to be permitted. Once the NISDOT permit has been issued, the user can then resume the Thruway Annual Permit Order and update the VIN on the vehicle screen. If you are ordering one of the two annual Thruway permits that require insurance, Thruway Sealed Container and Thruway Seal Haulers Permit, your company must have insurance on file. If your company has not uploaded an insurance accord or the uploaded insurance has not been approved, the throughway permit will not self-issue. Once you have advanced through the permit order, checked the attest statement on the summary screen, and clicked the submit button, Hooks will notify you that your company does not have active insurance on file. The application can still be submitted to the permit office, but it will not be issued until the insurance has been uploaded and approved. To order a throughway authority special hauling explosive trip permit, Companies must have a valid Thruway Authority Annual Explosive Permit on file. If your company does not have the Annual Explosive Permit on file, Hooks will alert the user once they click the Next button after starting the permit. For instructions on how to obtain a Thruway Authority Annual Explosive Permit, contact the Thruway Authority Office of Traffic Management at 518-436-3079. Once your company has the Thruway Authority Annual Explosive Permit on file, users will be able to order a special hauling explosive trip permit. 
To order a special hauling trip permit, select Thruway Authority Special Hauling Trip Permit from the Permit Type drop-down list after verifying all contact information and delivery method is up to date. Clicking in the From field will display a calendar. This will allow a start date to be selected. The Special Hauling Trip Permit will be valid for one day. Click the Next button to advance to the Truck and Load Information screen. This screen will allow the user to select the vehicle type, enter the load description, serial number, and enter the load parameters. If vehicles are already saved in company data, a vehicle can be chosen from the Vehicle Inventory drop-down list. Hooks will populate the known information about the vehicle into the associated fields. If there are no previously uploaded vehicles, the vehicle information will need to be entered manually. Enter the unit number, if there is one, the year, make, VIN, license plate number, and the state for which the vehicle is plated in the appropriate fields. Select the vehicle type being permitted from the Vehicle Type drop-down list if it is not automatically populated. The load description and serial number are required fields. Enter a specific load description of the load being hauled and the serial number. If there is not an applicable serial number, enter NA in the Serial Number field. This will pertain to all permits that require a serial number. You must attest that the load is non-divisible or that hauling multiple items does not create an additional overdimension. By checking the I attest that the load is non-divisible attest statement, you are confirming that the load being hauled cannot be broken down further or disassembled as per New York State rules. The bottom section allows you to enter your load parameters such as the width, height, length, front and rear overhang, and loaded weight. To add your loaded weights, click Enter Axles. There is a separate video located on the page help at the top right of the dashboard titled How to Set Axle Weights and Groups. Click the Next button to advance to the Enter a Route screen. This is where the entrance and exits will be entered to generate a route. Select the entrance from the Entrance Number 1 drop-down list and the exit from the Exit Number 1 drop-down list. If you will be traveling on and off the thruway, there are four available options to select the different entrances and exits. NISDOT Travel is not allowed for the thruway only permits. If you need NISDOT Travel, you will have to delete the thruway permit and order a NISDOT permit that includes thruway travel. Once the entrances and exits have been entered, click the Validate and Run button to generate a route. The origin is shown with a green O. The route is the blue line and the destination is the red D. The map can be moved by clicking and dragging. Users can also zoom in or out on the map using the scroll wheel on the mouse or the plus and minus icons located in the upper left corner of the map. Each red highlight is a restriction based on the dimensions entered on the previous screen. To view the restrictions along the route, Zoom into the restriction, click the Get Restriction Information for Road Radio button located above the routing map, and then select the segment for which more information is needed. The Restriction Information box will display. The Restriction box will display the exact restriction and the reason travel is not allowed on that portion of the route. The load dimensions used during routing, any conditional overrides if applicable, a short route description, the turn-by-turn -turn directions, and distance are all listed under the routing map. If there are any problems with the route and the application needs to be reviewed, click the Do Not Auto Issue I Would Like to Have My Application Reviewed checkbox. In the empty text field, type the requested route and the reason the request for the alternate route is being made. This will send the permit application to the Thruway Permit Office for review. An additional video titled Routing is located on the page help at the top right of the dashboard detailing more routing options and features. Clicking the Next button will display the Permit Fee Summary screen where all information, including the vehicle information, dimensions, route, and fees should be verified. Click the Submit button to proceed to the Permit Submission Successful screen. The permit will now be located in the shopping cart if you do not wish to pay for it now. From this screen, you can return to the dashboard or pay for the permits. Since this permit is self-issue and will not be submitted for review, click the Pay for Permits Now link to proceed with the payment. If the permit is not self-issue, the Pay for Permits Now link will not be available and a message will display stating the permit has been on queued for further review. Clicking the Pay for Permits Now link will display the Pay for Permits screen. Verify the permits listed for the payment are those that were selected for purchase. Click the Pay for Verified Permits button to continue the payment process or click the Cancel button to return to the company dashboard. The payment information screen will be displayed. 
Select the payment method from the drop down list and click the submit button. If escrow is selected, the payment will immediately be processed. If credit card is selected, you will be redirected from Hooks to the credit card processor site. Please note that while a credit card payment is processing, do not use the forward or back buttons on your browser. Once the payment is complete, the confirmation page will allow you to return to the dashboard. If paying by escrow, the issued permit screen will be displayed, listing the issued permit numbers as a hyperlink to the permit PDF that can be printed or emailed as needed. If you previously selected your delivery method as fax or email, the permits will also be sent at this time. Any routing and special instructions will be printed on the permit itself. The permits will be listed on the company dashboard once paid for and issued. Clicking on the permit number link will open the permit PDF for you to save or print. This concludes the Hooks user tutorial video on ordering new thruway permits. Thanks for watching and don't forget more videos are available for your convenience.